This video is about how to make a really good joystick in Scratch in under 40 blocks. Watch till the end of the video to see how you can move the joystick over to other projects. We will first remove Scratch Cap, then hover over Choose a Sprite and click Choose a Sprite. You can choose whatever you'd like to move. I will be using the Beach Ball Sprite. Once you have this here, make two new sprites hovering over Choose a Sprite and clicking Paint. For this first sprite, we will call it Joystick. You want a circle that is 30 by 30 pixels. Make sure it is filled in. Hold Shift while making the circle to make it perfectly round. Remember to left click down on it and make sure it snaps into the center. This is really important, so make sure you do this. Then cover over Choose a Sprite and click Paint. For this one, we'll call this sprite Joystick Edge. You want a circle that is not filled in and is 80 by 80 pixels big and 4 pixels thick. So make sure you remove the fill and remember to hold down Shift while making the circle. That should be good. After creating these three sprites, go to the Beach Ball Sprite and get ready to code. Go to the Events section and grab out a when green flag clicked block. After this, we will go on to make two variables, direction and power. For all sprites, make sure you untick the checkboxes. After this, go to control and grab a forever block. Go to motion and grab two blocks, point in direction, and Make sure you go to the variables and drag out the direction variable and put it right here. The next block that we will need is the move block. Then come over here back to variables and drag in power into this. After this, we will then go on to code the joystick edge block. So we'll go to events, grab out a win green flag click block and grab out a go to block. And for this tutorial, I have some preset numbers. So it's negative one, nine, two, and negative one three eight. That should take it to this corner right here. After this, go to the joystick sprite. Grab a green, when green flag click block, go to block for a loop, a uh, if then else block, and an if block. After this, come over here to sensing and grab out the mouse down. Then you need to grab out a few operator blocks. Grab out an and block, uh, not two not blocks and two equal blocks. Place them in this order as shown on the screen. After this, come over to the motion category and grab out X position and Y position. Place them here. Make sure the equals are zero. After this, grab this block and place it right here. We will now create a custom block. Click on the My Blocks category and click Make a Block. Make sure to call it Control. Click Run Without Screen Refresh and grab out the Control block that you just made and put it right there. After this, we'll have to put some code in. Grab out the Glide block and click Make it Glide 0. 0 0.05 seconds to joystick edge and remember to set the power to zero grab a go to joystick edge block a point to words and a set direction and set power to blocks We'll put the direction block and we'll put in the distance to mouse pointer one right here. It's in sensing. After this, grab an if else block and a repeat loop. Then come back to operators and grab out a lesser than block. Then grab this distance to mouse pointer block and put it right here. Make sure this is 50, if it isn't already. Then we'll grab out this distance to mouse pointer block again and put it right here. Now we just need it to move one step.
and in the else category just grab this and place it right here but remove this and change the repeat number to 50. So next we will test this out so click full screen and press the green flag and as you can see it works but as you may see the ball is going really fast and you might want to adjust the speed of the ball so come back to beach ball and move this out and grab a divide by so if we divide power by 10 power will be one tenth of what is controlled by the joystick so now as you may see the the beach ball moves much slower now before putting the code in your backpack make sure to test it out move the joystick make sure you have full screen before moving it or else you might just move the joystick sprite once you know that everything works put the joystick and joystick edge block in your backpack then come over here to beach ball and make sure you only put this code in. Do not put the beach ball sprite in it. Combined with this joystick technique and this get famous on scratch video, you can actually become the next Griff Patch.